Hello guys, welcome back to Dmox uh, Designs Creative, uh, where we provide a hundred percent youth empowerment programs. And uh, <clears throat> today we're going to talk about uh, how to uh, design a T-shirt, how to uh, uh, have a T-shirt. Uh, mockups or uh, how to design a, a t-shirt so that you can maybe have a printing or a, a design of your of or a color of your choice uh, to the t-shirt that you really need uh, maybe when you're doing a design and you want to have a t-shirt of a specific color or a t-shirt of a specific uh, uh, texture and then you a, a, a embed or you place uh, some 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 texts or uh, an image on on your or on your picture on your t-shirt sorry for that case so today we're going to say um t-shirt uh, uh branding t-shirt uh t-shirt uh, uh t-shirt uh branding or how we can actually brand or uh, design a t-shirt or uh, definitely brand a t-shirt so uh, without uh, much ado, uh, welcome back uh, to this uh, tutorial, uh, concentrate, uh, I need uh, your 100% concentration and if maybe you miss something on, uh, on the tutorial you can always uh, play back so that uh, you can uh, have a good grasp of uh, the concept or the process of what we are doing. So uh, I want to start off. And to start off, I will change my background. I would like to have a, a background that is a bit more attractive to my t-shirt that I do have. So to get a design or a, to get a t-shirt mock-up, you can always go to uh, you can always go to uh, Google and then you can do uh, a search of a t-shirt mock-up. Uh, a search of a t-shirt mock-up and then you can get uh, the t-shirts of your choice uh, you can get a, a t-shirt that you want to blend or to brand or to change the color or make it look uh, the way you want the color of your organization or anything that uh, you feel that uh, you need to have so for us we chose uh, we've chosen this t-shirt and then I will uh, copy this image and then I will paste it to my uh i will paste it to my figma interface so i have it there there we go i have my t-shirt so let me reduce this t-shirt uh mock-up so that it can uh, at least fit my screen so we want to make this t-shirt uh change the color of the we want to change the color of this t-shirt to the color of our choice so remember this is an image so you cannot actually play uh, play around with the image you can't change the color of the image you can only adjust uh, the image you can only either crop it or rotate it or uh, do anything on it uh, uh, provided that uh, you can you can uh, you can do fill you can fit you can crop you can tile it but you can't change the color of this t-shirt unless you do what i will I, i'm going to show you right now so don't don't move away let's see how it works let's see uh, how it works so here let me have a copy of this t-shirt let me have a copy of this t-shirt so this is now the process aha uh -huh, you get a copy of that t-shirt and then from there i can make this t-shirt uh now the the original t-shirt that i am having i can decide to have uh, uh to do some changes on it so i have the original duplicate of the t-shirt and then the original I have a duplicate and then the original so i can play around with the original so that i can uh, get a different color so take a pick a shape uh maybe pick a square and then place it here 
and then uh, and enlarge it grow it so that it goes uh, over and below uh, the t-shirt that we do have and then uh, enlarge it move it to a point like there and don't don't uh, uh, close it uh, completely uh, just need to see the the, the original t-shirt just a part of it and then uh, you can group this uh, you can group this just the the t-shirt and the rectangle control and G so when you group it you can see that uh, I have grouped it so after that uh, you need to uh, come to the t-shirt so you can uh, click on uh, control then you get the box you click on the box of the t-shirt and then you mask good did you see that when you mask uh, you have your t-shirt there we've picked the color of the rectangle has picked the actually and then after you mask uh, you size it so that you can see the full t-shirt and then click outside now you have your t-shirt now you have your t-shirt now remember the original color of the t-shirt was uh, white so we've changed this uh, to the color of the rectangle that we had so from there we can change uh, this color of the t-shirt that we have we can change the color of uh, our t-shirt right away we can change the color the way we want and then we can pick this t-shirt here the original t-shirt and then we can place it over uh, uh, the, the duplicate t-shirt sorry then we can place it on the original t-shirt then you come here and then click on uh, when you come to the layer click on multiply see that when you click on multiply the color of the original t-shirt uh, it, uh, it, 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 is, uh, it, it gets into the mask of the, uh, the, the, the color or the color of the duplicate has actually been masked by the original t-shirt. So here we can group this, we can group this, we can group it so that it can be one. So you can see that, do you see that? So with this I can change uh, the color of this t-shirt uh, as I wish. I would, if my organization is a purple color organization or if any, any color or you want to choose a color of your choice, you can always do that. You can always do that. You don't have any limit to that, fact, uh, to that matter. So let me have uh, this color yellow here. I think this looks so nice. So from here I can place any uh, image I can place any uh, deco or any artwork or an e uh, or a, a name as I w I do wish so we can decide to maybe have a, a name uh, from maybe I was working on uh, uh, this uh, uh, flyer here let me group it then let me copy this and then take it to my t-shirt let me take it to my t-shirt good okay aha so i can paste it here i can paste it here uh, i can paste it there so i can reduce this to the size of my choice so that it can fit uh, inside my t-shirt so I can decide to have this see that I can even decide uh, I can group this so that it becomes one and then I can decide to uh, do any writing just below it I can decide to have any writing uh, let me change the color and the font size let's see let, let me have 20 and then let me change the color to something to do with purple good so then i can come here and write dmox design creative 
cool so I can have it there can have it there you can group it so that it becomes one so uh, look at this I can do anything I can place any image I can play around with the p uh, with the the, the the image so that's our first uh, uh, way of actually changing or designing or branding a t-shirt that's the first way you can do it that's the first method you may also like to have this uh, these words here or this flyer cover the whole t-shirt cover the whole t-shirt uh, you may decide to have maybe a different image you may decide to have a photo you may decide to get an image from uh, the, 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 the images or from Google or from anywhere and then you want this image to fill this you want this image to fill the whole of this huh? so let's see let's see how it works let's have a copy of this uh, t-shirt that we do have let's have a copy of it good did I have a copy no let, let me have a con copy of it so alt and then good so uh, this is our copy of, of the t-shirt that we do have so let me look for an image so that I can play around with it so let me see if I can get an image from wallpaper yes yes I can decide to have any sort of image I can decide to have any sort of image uh, which one looks uh, more appealing uh, huh. let me pick let me pick any image let me pick this one good let me copy it let me copy that image and then let me take it to my t-shirt so let's see let's see what happens here good so here I want to place this uh, uh, wallpaper that I have just brought in there it comes so let me uh, the, you, you need to increase it so that it appears uh, bigger over uh -huh. uh, so that that image is uh, bigger than uh, I think I did uh, I, I was too yeah, yeah let me just have it uh, that size so I want this image uh, the whole of this color to fit in uh, that t-shirt so how do we do that how do I do that I want to make this color the whole of this image to fit in see now it's not fitting in even if you try to do uh, even if you bring it the other side or the other t-shirt so it's not actually allowing me to have my t-shirt uh, the, the image actually picking uh, being picked by the t-shirt so to do that uh, what you need to do you can ungroup this you can ungroup uh, this t-shirt let's see control shift and then G did we ungroup it can ungroup this t-shirt so that we can we just want to have a rectangle of this t-shirt the t-shirt that we have which one is that now we have it this is it this is now the rectangle this rectangle check on the rectangle so we want to place our image this image on top of this rectangle that uh, accommodates our t-shirt mark that place the image on top of the rectangle that uh, contains or hosts or uh, accommodates our t-shirt if you don't do that you will miss it totally you will miss it so let's take this uh, where is our t-shirt? Uh, where is our where is our image? Let's see where is our image. Where is our image? I'm looking for our image. Uh, I think our image is on top there. That's our image. Bring it down on top of that rectangle. See it disappears. 
but you can see the rectangle uh, has been left there so because we are on, on that rectangle where is the rectangle the, we are on the image because we are on the image you can click on shift then the arrow keys you drag with the left uh, direction the left arrow key direction drag on the left arrow key see that look at that miracle see that wow see that so our image looks to be too uh, it's smaller it's smaller let me go back and see we want to fill the whole t-shirt with the image so let me get back there let me increase uh, the size of the uh, that image and then make sure you are on that click on shift and then drag let me let me bring the t-shirt on the center click and drag 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 there we go we have our t-shirt we can we can delete this or remove this can delete or remove this so we can have our t-shirt uh, outside uh, we can also remove this or we can we can delete we can delete that we can also delete that sorry uh, we can delete this good good now we have our t-shirt in the shape and the color that we wanted fully branded so guys uh thank you you have seen the magic you can decide to have any object you can have a t-shirt you can decide to have a cup a plate or anything you can play around with that and then you use uh, the simple steps that I have uh, taken you through and boom there you go you get it so thank you guys for uh, giving me uh, the opportunity to take you through this I know I have helped someone and uh, go and do practice do practice you cannot understand this thing unless you do uh, thorough practice so thank you guys remember to subscribe to my channel until we meet again uh, in our next tutorial see ya